Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome to this game that I was always raging on, on my Twitch channel. And surprisingly, I have a sore throat right now. So guess what? I'm still recording videos. Why? Because I told you guys that I was really, really going to try to make YouTube become something more than what it is now. And especially even now while I'm live streaming, I figured, let's do it. Let's go all out this year and see how far I can actually do this. Now anyways, this game is called 8-Bit Boy. It's a game where I completely rage and all that stuff, so I'm gonna go ahead and look at the settings very quick. And just kinda lower the music a little bit. Nah, we're okay, we need this. Uh, let's see... Set keys. Whoops, whoops. Oh! What am I doing? Okay, F1. F1, F1, F1. Okay, let me go back here again and uh, go into the settings. Alright, you know what? Screw it. Let's just get in there, and we're gonna try to figure out how to play the game. I don't know why I was doing that. So we're gonna go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and try. Create new game. Choose your difficulty. Auto saves after completing a level, and you have more time to for exploring. This mode is for the average gamer. Find the hidden special coins to save your progress. Time is very limited. This mode is for the insanely skilled gamer only. Yeah, let's not go there right now. Ooh, a cutscene. And there, little Johnny once realized that he has Time Warner Cable. Sorry. Life was not what he had expected. He wasn't disappointed with life, per se. But he certainly was disappointed in himself. Jeez. When was the last time he was truly happy? I don't know. Probably when that new episode of Pokemon Season 1 came on, huh? Am I right, guys? When was the last time he had woke up in the morning and thought to himself, this is going to be a good day? Well, for me, it's when it's a good day. Pun intended. None of you will get it. Finally passing his exams one year ago just to be faced with unemployment didn't help either. Hmm, sounds a lot like California right now. This was not what he had expected at all. At age 32, he felt like he had accomplished very little. I feel like that right now. Half finished education, courses, and the odd jobs in between weren't something to be proud of. He thought. It certainly wasn't how he had met how he had imagined his life would be when he was twenty when he was a kid twenty years ago. It all seemed so long ago. Like in another lifetime. He tried to remember how life was back then. Back when he used to play games all day long on his trusted console. He got it for his 10th birthday, and oh what a joy it was! He simply loved that thing and dreamed about growing up and making games himself one day. It all seemed so silly now, knowing you have to grow up and take responsibility. He wondered if he, had, if he still had it in the basement. Would it even work after all these years? He felt an urge to go look in the basement right away. He almost felt excited about finding it, and couldn't even remember the last time he felt that way about anything. Damn. He went down in the dark basement. The air was cold, thick, and moist. Yes, moist. It made him a bit nauseous and lightheaded. He looked through what seemed like an endless number of moving boxes, crates, and bags. But finally, he found what he was looking for, in the far and darkest corner of the room, the old 8-bit console. So many good memories, just thinking about filled, just thinking about, just thinking about filled him with bittersweet nostalgia. I don't know why that took for, I don't know why I stuttered on that one. He looked through some of the old games, most of them were a little fuzzy around the label, and some even had mold on him. That's disgusting! Suddenly, when he was struck with fear, looking at the last game cartridge in the pile. Spooky. <laughs> it seemed completely new and shiny. It even had that harsh chemical smell to it that new plastic usually has. Oh, I remember that. No dance or scratches like all the other games. But what filled him with fear was the empty label on the top of the cartridge. It had the print and pattern of the other cartridges, but the title, but it was missing the title. As if it was just waiting on someone to fill it in. He couldn't explain why this filled him with pure eerness. I think I said that right. It just did. 
A tiny and very subtle voice inside him whispered a chanting, Play it! Play it! Play the game! I'm just kidding. Over and over again, like an echo from beyond. I would probably want to punch that voice. Like he had no saying in this, he started rigging up the console to his old color TV to try the uncanny cartridge. Somehow this was what he had to do. Somehow this was his fate. Or destiny. After setting up the console, an old dusty office desk down in the basement, he plugged in the strange looking cartridge. The cartridge didn't need the usual push to go the way down to the slot. It felt more like it was pulled right in. Like two magnets just before touching each other. Or when you hug your, your girlfriend or boyfriend and you just like kind of squeeze. Oh no, it's not like that. It's not. It's, it's magnet. I thought love was kind of like magnetic. Find in. Just before flipping the wall switch, he hesitated that just long enough to realize that this was a very bad idea. A very bad idea indeed. Then he flipped the switch. And you know what the game said? It was his hand, Mr. Krabs. He was number one. I just wanted to add that in there because of the suspenseful music. Oh. What's going on? Oh, damn! We're going digital! Oh, there was an angel thingy at the top! What the hell? Why didn't we talk? Hey, look, birdies! E. Look at that, that looks like a far fetch. Loading tutorial. Sweet, looks like we're starting. Alright, press A or up to jump. Okay, we can do that. You can adjust the you can adjust the jump height by pressing the jump longer or shorter. Liar! I can't skip. Eh, 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 eh. Alright, let's do this. Oh, it's a spring. Boing. Yeah. Wait, what was that? I wonder what that was. All right, there we go. It says, "Please wait." All right, jump up the jump up from beneath a tile marked with a plus sign, just like I did. Pick up the berry to gain the the shooting ability. Shooting ability, eh? Oh, look at that! Oh, I thought it was gonna hit me. Hey, this is kind of like Mario. He's a Mario. All right. Press B or space to shoot. I kind of figured that. Oh, look at that. Hey, Die. Is he dead? Yeah, he is. Oh, and I guess he holds space to kind of jump up in there. Okay, that one worked. No, we ain't leaving. Come on, we can do that one. Oh! Oh! Nice. Nice. I got that guy. Did you see him? I got him. He dead! He's a dead! Alright, speed jump. Yep, just like I figured. Hold down the space bar and then you jump longer and uh, well, bam Sweet. That was fairly easy. But again, you guys, this was something I was raging on a live stream. There's five worlds. And we're going to world one. Alright! I guess this is where the adventure starts. Okay, let's see. <laughs> What's that? Oh, it shoots two! By the power of two! Look at that, it's a farfetch. I still want to call it a farfetch. There's like some- Oh! Oh, hey! Coins! I wonder if it's gonna give me extra health if I collect all 100. How come I can't get that thing? Whatever. Ah, oh, that was easy. Oh, oh, oh! Where's he going? Yeah! Alright, so blue birds take twice. Ooh. What does this one do? Oh, sh No! No, I lost it! God damn it! Oh my god, I'm losing all the power-ups in the freaking world right now. 
Let's try not to do that again. What's up here, though? Okay, it wouldn't break the first time. GG Remix, you lost your only power up in the freaking game. Oh, oh! What's this? Hey! Nice! I didn't even know that was. I didn't even know that was there! Sweet, but the level is cleared. Alright, let's take a look at our stats here. I almost had 30,000. Alright, that's fine. Let's go. This is actually way better than the time I played it on the live stream. Except I didn't lose all power ups on the live stream. I, d I didn't lose any power ups until like I felt. And you guys will probably see the moments I fail in this game. It's gonna be pretty bad. Like that, for example. I am not gonna risk that. So I'm just gonna go over here and see. And there's no coins. Okay. Nope. Nope. Okay. Oh, I got him. Oh! Eh. Eh. Damn it. Alright, there's that out of the way. That was just luck. Alright, we go down. That was funny. I don't know why that was funny for me. Nice. Oh, that was crazy. What is that thing? Oh, wow. He could have gone to the bottom of that. Man. Why do these games gotta have so many secrets? Alright, here we go. Oh. Come on, come on. Yeah. 